What's going on guys? Today's video is about DNS troubleshooting. I've gotten this web page a few times. It's saying something's wrong with my DNS. And if you don't know what DNS is, it's basically like google.com. It's a name for a website instead of an IP address. It just makes it easier for us as humans to remember names instead of IP addresses. And sometimes the DNS can get corrupted or some things can actually mess it up. So here's what you can do. The very first thing I love to do is clearing the cache and cookies. On any browser, you can hit Control Shift and Delete. I like to just choose cache and cookies or temporary internet files in Internet Explorer and then just delete. Um, if that doesn't fix it, you can go into the command prompt by hitting the window symbol and R and then typing CMD or you can type in CMD in the start menu. And then once you get into the command prompt, type in IP config space slash flush like you flush a toilet and then DNS. This will clear the DNS cache so every time you go to a website the computer will actually save the DNS entry and sometimes that can get corrupted so we're clearing that. Um, another thing you could try in Internet Options in Internet Explorer go into the Connections click on LAN settings and sometimes there might be a proxy set up sometimes malware might actually add an IP address in there which can jack your computer up so you want to make sure that box is unchecked if you've done all that and it's still not working the best thing to do is right click the network adapter at the bottom click on open network sharing center click on adapter setting right click whatever adapter you're using wireless or ethernet click on properties and then click on Internet Protocol version 4 and hit Properties. So if you see an IP address in this Preferred DNS or Alternative DNS, uh, you want to make sure Obtain DNS Server Address automatically because sometimes malware can actually add IP addresses into this DNS and they're making you go through their DNS servers and that is big trouble. Something you might want to try if you don't see an IP address is actually use the following DNS and actually put 8.8.8.8 in the preferred and 8.8.4.4 in alternative. That's actually the Google DNS. Sometimes viruses can cause this issue. So I recommend downloading malware bytes and running a full scan. Or sometimes malware or bad programs can cause this too. So I recommend going into your programs and feature and removing any bad programs on your computer. I have seen where it is the ISP that's having the issue. So in my area we have Comcast. So I can actually go to Comcast Outage and there are maps out there that will show you if there's something going on with the ISP at the time. Or it could be the company actually having some routing or DNS issues themselves. Uh, you know, all else fail, reset the modem. You know, see if that fixes it or restart the computer. Thanks again guys for watching. If you have any other DNS troubleshooting advice, please put it in the comments. Or if you want any other tips or tutorials like how to speed up your computer or how to remove virus. And also guys, please subscribe. I'm going to be doing Tech Tuesdays and also Gaming Thursday, which this Thursday I'm going to actually do a review on an upscaler for classic gaming consoles. So guys, have a great day.